guys, welcome back to my channel. So I recorded this video and um, my review video of three products from my winter FabFitFun box. And it recorded, but when I went to go check it out, it was gone and said that it didn't capture anything, which is so odd. But I can do a recap on everything. So this um, mascara, m m <laughs> mascara, it's called Ilya, I think. Don't get me wrong. It's backwards. At least it looks backwards. Um, so this mascara is awesome. I really, really like it. It is Limitless Mascara, and it's buildable. Um, that's what they were advertising. But when I was using it, it was, in fact, uh, buildable, and it was very nice. It was easy to apply it. I know I have very difficult time applying mascara. It tends to drip and get messy and kind of clawed up, and it looks really bad. Uh, but this, I really like. Would I recommend it to a friend? Yes, I would. Um, but this, w would I ever use this again? Yes, I would. Would I ever buy it again? Um, if I wasn't worried about money-wise, yes, I would buy it again. Because I really like it, and it's smooth, and I love the packaging and stuff like that. It's like super durable. And it's not plastic. I mean, it doesn't feel like plastic. Um, so, yeah. I really liked this mascara. I'm not exactly sure if it's waterproof or not. But it got onto my eyes pretty good. Um, no clumping or, I mean, there's a little bit. Obviously, that's normal. But it was uh, easily applicable. Didn't get really messy. I mean, I do have a little bit, but that's kind of normal, cause I, and I didn't touch up on it. So, yeah, this is a super good mascara, and if I wasn't ever worried about money-wise, I would buy it again. Uh, Phase Zero Blush. Like I said in the other video and um, earlier... I really like the packaging of this because I'm super clumsy. I tend to drop things constantly. Um, and a lot of like my eyeshadows and blushes, their lids are broken. A lot of the makeup I've had since I was like 16. Uh, so don't judge me. Uh, yeah. So this is really good quality packaging. Now the inside... I don't have nails, so, um, really good mirror, and, um, it's very clear, the product on the inside, the blush, is really good and it's not like super powdery where it would get everywhere and if I would have applied it with a brush it would have been better but I didn't go and get my blush out um, yeah so I th and it's really good quality uh, it's not breaking out my skin at all and um, and I have very sensitive skin so if that's something that, uh, if your skin is super sensitive, like, don't quote me on it, but, um, this isn't making me break out. So, I mean, it might be an option for someone who has, um, sensitive skin. Yeah, so I really liked this product. So the next product is the lip scrub. I've never used lip scrub before. I promise it tastes gross. Don't even try to see if it has a taste or if it tastes like vanilla bean. This isn't like normal like lip gloss or anything. Um, it's vanilla bean lip scrub. 
Woosh. I think the uh, brand is called Woosh. Uh, it gently exfoliates, smooths, and softens. It's paraben free, sulfate free, DEA and T free, cruelty free, and petrochemical free. And it's Leaping Bunny certified. And it's organic. I apologize for my nails. My nails are kind of gross. So yeah. So I put it on. I and I'm I let it sit. It's been sitting there probably way too long because it looks like I'm not wearing anything because it kind of like absorbed uh, because it's been on my lips for two videos. So I am going to go. Wash it off. I mean, it was nice. It wasn't bad. It didn't irritate my skin. But I'm going to go wash it off and come back and explain how I'm feeling and what it did for me. I will see you soon. Be right back. I'm back. So I went and washed it off. I know it kind of seems like it didn't. But what I noticed is my lips feel a little bit plumper than normal. I don't know, if, and it kind of looks plumper. I don't know if you guys notice it, but I, I do. Um, my lips are super soft, and there's not really any, because I have a habit of having, like, getting really bad chapped lips, and so, like, I have, like, dead skin. I don't anymore. So, I mean, and, and it renews, moisturizes, and exfoliates. So, I think what it said, what it, or it said, or did what it said. <laughs> Sorry. So, the lip scrub did what it said. I like it. Would I ever get it again? I mean, yeah. If I wasn't worried about money. Um,. I wouldn't use it often, but I know when I when my lips get really bad, I will use it. So I mean, it will last me forever. So yeah, I really like these products. And um, my last video was like 18 minutes long, and this is only like two minutes long. Um, and the reason of that is because I was also, and I, I was applying these in my videos, but um, basically what I was also talking about when I was applying the stuff in the other video that didn't work out, um, I was talking about a new series that I'm going to be doing on my channel, and it is going to be about my weight loss journey and becoming healthy. I will try to record workouts and walks and talk about what I'm doing and what I'm eating and stuff like that. De-stressing because stress has a lot to do with weight gain and weight stalling where you can't lose the weight. So um, yeah, uh, that's what I'm going to be doing. I will actually be doing the other products and stuff that I got in my winter fab fit fun box in another video like this one the hair mask smells like rain it actually doesn't smell like rain it smells like a light fragrance but you can barely smell it you literally have to like force yourself but like, like really hard just to smell the fragrance and it doesn't smell bad at all so who knows how that hair mask is going to turn out. Packaging's pretty. Um, so that is going to be in another video that I'm going to be doing in testing some of the FabFitFun products. I actually got this in my fall box. It's a little water bottle. I wanted to take a drink in my other video. But couldn't because... I had the lip scrub on. Okay, so 
And I actually really love this. I use it all the time. And I don't always use this. And when I'm not using this, I use it to make spiritual moon water, which is basically using purified water and uh, letting it sit in a full moon or a special moon, like an eclipse or a half moon or something. Uh, to accumulate energy to use it for manifesting and some other things. I might do a video on that when the next special moon happens. So, love to get started on that. But yeah, and I am using this. So, this is going to be in the other video. This was like $50 or something. It was it's pretty nice. So, um... Thank you for, this is going to be a short video, I'm sorry, um, but yeah, if the other video would have worked out, it would have been a lot longer, but this is all I could give you right now, but I will be doing more content today, so I will see you there. If you like my videos and you want to see more of me, just like and subscribe, uh, liking the video helps spread the video everywhere so other people can see it um my eyes look so big right now I don't know if it's the mascara or what but like the colors in my eyes look deeper and my pupils look so odd almost bit everywhere uh yeah so I really like the mascara I liked all the products that I used today and um if you want these products, just go to FabFitFun and order your own box. Shop on the website to find these things. They're a bit pricey, but I think when you get on FabFitFun, they're a bit ch cheaper. I don't know. Um, you can get them on add-ons if you want for half off. At least that's what I was told. Don't quote me on that. But yeah. Um, if you would like to see more, just like and subscribe, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.